Hey, uh, Chris here from um, LARP, LARPing Ogres of Michigan. Um, we do a lot of LARP stuff and we're always finding new things. And we stumbled upon Steampunk about around October and it was like, cool, Halloween costume. And it also can be used for like a robot or Android. Um, I'll show you this first. This is my gun and holster. Uh, this is just a squirt gun. You can find at a uh, dollar store anywhere, Ace Hardware. Um, I'll let you take a look at it. It's just a squirt as you can see the hand of the little thing, it's a squirt gun. Um, and then I took the bottle and I added a squirt bottle there and I just glued it on and painted it up with nail polish and gold spray paint. That's that. That's the gun. And for the holster, it's very simple. Uh, you just, basically what you do is you take a piece of paper and you wrap it around your gun and see how it will fit comfortably. And then you get the basic shape. And that's what this is. That's what this first part is. Then you take a... Uh, the color fabric of your outfit so it matches or just brown and you put it on your uh, you glue it around the outside of that then you take a piece of co this is a, this is cardboard by the way not paper this is a uh, cardboard as well and uh, this is where your belt you cut two slits and you slip your belt through there and um, you just do the same basic idea you hot glue fabric all the way around it and it will look nice like this and you hot glue this to that and put your gun in it while it's hot glued so you can get the proper shape and then really hot glue the crap out of it. Whether it will hold or not, I don't know. I never had a chance to use it. I thought it would be cool to have a little shoulder piece and hand thing, so I made this. Uh, this slip, I'll show you real fast, so it would be the best way to do it. Okay, um, this is, this basically consists of belts, or wood, and hinges, those are hinges. This is out of the old radio. I made it look like steampunk. I took a little faucet thing. This is for my left shoulder. And basically this belt, you you wear a nice shirt underneath it and you belt it up just like, uh, make sure it's not crooked. You belt it up just like this. And um, it slips under your arm and you find your hole and you just put it there. And then you tie it up because I don't have a loop for it. You just tie it open over. Sweet. Um, okay, now that that's on, uh, the rest of this, this is all just plastic tubing I found laying around. And here's the uh, hand. This is a welder's glove, and these are bits of the radio too. I just take them to put them up to a candle and melted them. So that our, I heated them up. Don't melt them, because it won't work. And um, that way it's connected. Just like that. But there's one more piece, and it's this. This is for your muscle or thing. Hook it up. I'm not going to show you guys how to make this because it's steampunk, man. Everything's unique. Make it your own. Slip it on. Put it up to your, your muscle there. And then put on your glove. Now, that's really cool, right? It looks awesome. Now, you need a vest which I got here, um, it's brown, it just slips on over everything and it covers the belt. Then for the top hat, thread bangers, look them up on YouTube, thread bangers. They make a really cool Mad Hatter's outfit, um, they're awesome. This is uh, their style of hat except what I did for the, uh, the brim here, instead of using the wire they used, I used an old coat hanger, a wire coat hanger. This is all cardboard um, and then I just put goggles on it because I used to weld for a minute, and there's my steampunk hat. Anyways, works for an Android. Looks pretty cool. If you want to know how to make it, I'll get into more detail. So let me know. Chris here, LARPing over.